Thanks, Dana. The new Bowling Green High School was officially unveiled today after years of anticipation. WBKA reporter Derek Parham was at the school today to show us the new updates. After over five years of planning, demolition, and construction, Bowling Green High School held an open house and unveiling of their new facilities today, revealing state-of-the-art classrooms, labs, and community spaces. You know, I think, the, I think the thing that all kids and staff wanted from the old building, they want common spaces were really important. We had a iconic commons in the old building. And so that was kind of what we started with. And so uh, today we had our, our, our grand opening in the new commons area with the social staircase. With an $80 million price tag and at almost 300,000 square feet, there were challenges in creating a state-of-the-art facility in the midst of a pandemic and in the wake of the tornadoes in 2021. So we had to figure out a way to uh, build a new building at the same time, you know, continue to have school in the old building. So it uh, took a lot of creativity. We had uh, great architects and construction managers and uh, our faculty and staff here and students have been great. Uh, Field says that through these challenges, the BGHS community remained patient and rallied together when needed. We've had a lot of uh, different uh, situations come up where they uh, some days park one place, the next day they park somewhere else. One day they eat someplace, the next day they eat somewhere else. So uh, to, to see it all come to, to a, all together here at the end has just been amazing. The end result speaks for itself, providing a space that fosters creativity, continued learning, and above all else, collaboration. I think throughout the building you see that collaboration aspect that is not just for, for students, but it's, it's teachers collaborating with each other, it's teachers collaborating with students, and students collaborating with students. While the main building and courtyard are now complete, in the next year and a half the campus will see a new area vocational center, on-site daycare for staff, and new tennis courts. Until then, reporting in Bowling Green, Derek Parham, WBKO News.